Hello guys, my name is Aditya and you are watching Aditya Tech World. In this video, I will be showing you how to boost your old PC for gaming. So in this video, you want to get to 20 to 30 percent increase in your gaming performance. So let's start with the video. <laughs> So hello guys welcome back again to the video I'll be showing you 10 steps to increase your windows performance for gaming So before that I'll give my PC specifications My Intel processor i5 CPU 2.6 GHz and can be clocked to 2.7 GHz My installed memory is 4 GB RAM And my video card is AMD Radeon 5000 HD series 512 MB so that's all about my specifications so before that please subscribe to my channel and click on the like button so guys let's get over to the first step go to your menu and search in for run open up refresh and click continue delete all the files from this folder Click skip if this shows this message. Close this folder again. Go to the run. Open temp again. Delete this folder. Close this folder. Then again, go to your menu and search in for run. Click percent temp percent. Open this folder. Delete all the files in this folder. If this shows this message, click skip and close this folder. You are done with this first step. So guys, before getting to the second step, I will give an important note that please fully watch this video. You can also damage this your PC if you uh, not do it properly. So let's get over to the second step. The second step would be increasing your power options. Go to your menu and search in for power options and click OK. It will get to you this uh, screen. Just click on the option of high performance and just close this folder. We are done with the second step. Let's move on to the second step. In the second step, we will remove all the unwanted programs from our computer. So we'll go to your control panel and go to program and features from there delete all the files which you don't need it like for example i don't need this laser jet soft for uh, software so i'll install it so after installing all the unwanted programs from your computer let's move on to the fourth step the fourth step would be cleaning the disk so get get over to the menu and search in for the disk cleaner then go to your c drive or the drive in which your windows install click ok and it will take some time for loading the files so wait for it so guys after it has calculated it will open this uh, uh, screen just click on clean up system files and it will again scan your C drive it will take some time just wait for it in some case it would take uh, longer time or in some cases it will take short time it depends on your computer speed so after the loading is done it will pop up this window click ok and delete all the files it will again take some time to clean up this disk so wait for it So after this is done, let's get over to the 
system will disable all the unwanted programs which run uh, when we start up our windows so let's get over to the task manager from there go to your startup bar and disable all the unwanted programs which you don't need while starting up your windows so as you can see here i have disabled cc cleaner because i don't need it uh, when my windows start up and also this adapter desktop app you can disable all the programs which don't, don't need it after that doing we have completed the fifth step when you get over to the sixth step you will disable all the unwanted services which you do do not need while gaming so go to your menu and search in for services Here you can see there are lot many services the services which you have to disable i have given in the description so i'll show you only the one services which i'll disable and you can disable other services also like that so first i'll disable diagnostic policy services Here you can see click ok just when you start up type click on manual and click ok apply then ok after doing that do it with all other services which are given in the description after that you have completed the sixth step let's get over to the seventh step the seventh step would be optimizing your disk so click on disk d fragment and open it it will open this and you can see there are three drives or the drives which you have installed in your computer so as you can see there are system reserved file just click on optimize and it will, it will optimize your drives if but if you are running on an ssd i will prefer that you should not do it because it will slow down your speed of your ssd if you are an hd drive then do it for sure after that close it and we are done with the same step let's move on to the eighth step we'll go to again to the menu and search in for ms config after opening this you will see the boot tab go to your advanced options and there will be an option for number of process click on that and click maximum number of processor which your computer has i have four i have four so i'll select four and then click ok and then click on apply and then ok it will uh, say for restart then restart your pc i will exit without restarting because uh, i don't need to st uh, restart because i have already done this so let's move on to the ninth step the ninth step would be going to your system go to your system and the there will be window and there will be option for advanced system options click on it go to your advanced tab and there would be a performance so go to your settings and change there from let windows flow choose what your best for computer change it to adjust for best performance and click apply and ok you can see uh, your window is appearing very weird it doesn't matter because we are increasing our gaming performance so guys the 10th step would be the most important step in this video because it will increase your gaming performance from 10 to 20 percent so the softwares which i am going to uh, tell you are given in the description you can download it from there uh, first of all the first software is razer cortex booster actually what it does it removes and uh, uh, stops all the unwanted programs when you are gaming and optimizes your gaming performance the second is cc cleaner which would uh, remove all the registry files and all the malicious softwares which you have in your computer and all the old files which your computer has saved which 
which is not needed by your computer now so the third program is updating your drivers so updating your driver is the most important thing for gaming because uh, the software companies give update for your driver so that you can play the uh, new uh, new updated games easily on your computer so i give in the description for both the drivers if an amd video card you can download it from there and if an nvidia driver you can download it from there so i'll go to you go to the razer uh, cortex booster and tell you how it works so when you install the razer cortex booster and run it for the first time it will ask for the login so for logging in you need to uh, type in your email address and your password and you will be able to log in so when you will run razer cortex booster so it will show you first this screen and it would be a games tab you just need to add any game in your pc and it will recognize it by its own if you run the game so i will go add for example i will add any game which i have in my computer so i have far cry 3 i'll open it and click add so here you can see the far cry 3 application has come you can play from here and it will optimize all the settings for playing far cry 3 as the best settings and if you uh, need to boost your pc fully then you can go here in the game booster tab and click on boost and defrag and tweak and this will ask for restarting your pc surely restart your pc it will not harm your pc after that you can when you play your pc you can see drastic change in the game performance so we will get to uh, go to the next software is cc cleaner so in cc cleaner you don't need any login like something that you will open this screen and you can see the cleaner tab click on the cleaner tab and go to analyze it will analyze all the uh, files uh, which your program has installed and it is useless and you uh, run the cleaner to clean all these files which you have uh, which the software has installed so as you can see the old windows installation files of 1kb these are all unwanted caches memory which are uh, stored in your computer will run the cleaner and click ok it will take uh, some time for the first time it would take about one to two minutes for running the cleaner you run and uh, run analyze four three times until you get this screen empty then go to the registry tab and from here scan for issues it will scan all the registry file if there is an uh, uh, harm or something like that it scans any a virus in your register data it will scan and fix that issue so it would take about one to two minutes for scanning then do we have to click on the fix selected issue get it first scan all the issues which i have in my laptop fix selected issues and click uh, no because i don't need to back up these registry files and click on the uh, fix all selected issues and then click ok then you can go to the tool tab and remove the programs uh, which, which you cannot remove from the control panel so it's very easy to uninstall you just need to click on any uh, program which you want to uninstall you just click on uninstall and it will be able to uninstall your program so that's all with the cc cleaner and for updating drivers i gave the links so guys that's all in a video if you like this video please click on the like button and share with among your friends and help them also to increase the gaming performance and click on the subscribe button if you are new to this channel so that's all in a video thanks for watching before that please ignore my mistakes if i have done 
in making my video thanks for watching